Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Willie. Today we're going to be trying to get a whole bunch of snook, maybe some redfish. I see fish uh, blowing up behind me, so I'm not going to sail uh, a while out here today. We really don't have no, uh, not too much wind, so I really don't feel like standing in the heat today. But um, we're going to see if we can put as many snook as possible. Both fly wheels are blacked out with bait. So we don't have no issue with bait today. So we're gonna get fishing, so guys, stay tuned. All right guys, first thing we're gonna do is just chum up the area with the white bait. Get some of the dead ones out of there. I think this is too heavy on me. There we go. There we go. Ah, oh, cool. Ooh, there they go. The fish are here. The fish are here. Ooh, what is that? I think those are jacks. I think those are jacks. I think those are jack of -alls. Let that bait swim up there. Ladyfish. Big ladyfish. He's so pretty perfect, so I'm gonna throw him up there by the, the dock. If a big snook and hit him. And, and I've been actually trying to put my hands on one of these guys. There you go, nice little jack. When you release them head first, because jack of alls never stop swimming, so you don't want to uh, just release them like you would any other fish. Straight down, let them take off. Woo! All right. See if we catch a few more. And uh, I might head in. I might just go try a new spot. I might go down and try a new spot here. Yeah, I'm going to pack it up and go try a new spot. Oh, there it is. Oh, trying to get it. Did you get it? Ah, oh, you almost had it. I gotta put some more leader on. Last one that I'm gonna retire, and that was that fast right there. That's a better one, guys. That's a better one. Yeah, I should have retired. That's a better snook. That's a better snook, and I should have retired. Don't lose this guy. He's barely hooked. Lost him at the boat. Couldn't stay pinned. Yeah. I gotta get my net. Get my net out. There's some bigger snook over there. I'm not losing. I'm not losing another fish again. Not to that. Oh, 
Rashad. As soon as it hit the water. As soon as it hit the water. As soon as it hit the water. Right there, he popped off right in the boat. There we go, nice little snook. All right, let me put some more leader on. I'm getting down to the, I'm getting down too low. All right, let's retie up here somewhere. I mean, he's big. I mean, he has to be at least 30 inches. There it goes. Little guy. There's a big one in here. There it is. There it is. Ah, small. They hit like they're huge. Oh, there's a bunch of jacks following them up. Get the camo. Same hooks I used yesterday, and it did absolutely amazing. That's a bigger fish. That's a bigger snook. That's a bigger snook. Oh, it feels like a jack. Oh my god. Oh my god, guys. <laughs> oh my gosh. That is a huge redfish. Oh my god. Oh man. Let's go, baby. This is my secret honey hole right here. Oh my, let me get my grips. I'm gonna have to end up putting my other GoPro on. Oh my gosh, guys. That is a massive redfish. Oh, that thing just fell right out of there. God. That is a beautiful redfish. Look at the spots on the tail. That is an absolutely beautiful redfish right there. Gorgeous. Finally landed one. Look at the spots on this side, guys. Look at that. Absolutely beautiful, beautiful redfish. Wow. I can't believe I finally got him. All right, let's let him go.
off he goes. Guys, heck yeah. That's the one I've been waiting for. That's the fish I've been waiting for. Wow, unbelievable. I knew there was some bigger fish in there. Get a little slow. I knew there were some bigger fish in there. I kept seeing the explosions. So I knew one of these baits was gonna be that bigger fish. And I was hoisting it, I was thinking it was a snook, so I had to drag pretty tight. And then once he flashed behind the boat, I was just like, oh my God, that is a huge red fish. I thought it was a jack at first, but that was a beautiful, beautiful red fish, guys. Let's see if we can catch another one. All right, guys, we're uh, put up to our next spot here. I never tried this spot before, so we're gonna see if we can get some uh, snook or something fired up and drop the troll motor and uh, get to it. Out. And only seen one snook blow up, so. I don't know. Maybe this might be a bust. Oh, there it is. That's a bigger fish. That's a big fish, guys. That's a nicer snook. That's a nicer snook right there. Hope it stays buttoned. Hopefully it stays buttoned up. That's a nicer fish right there. Get my net ready. There we go. I know I saw one over there in that corner, for sure. Uh, come out of there. There we go. Not big, not a monster, but you can tell he's a lot darker. Sitting back here in this back creek. But it's definitely a nice fish. You're mad at that. Oh. Woo, don't get on the camera. I see some more fish over here busting, so I guess they're finally uh, starting to wake up a little bit here. See if we can get another bait out there. Saw something busting up against this little yellow thing here. Oh, there it is. Oh, he pulled off. Come on. That bait's still alive. So he just swung at him. Oh, there it is. There it is. Nice little slip there. Nice little snook, guys. Oh, he swallowed that pretty deep. Might better get that out of there. That's what happens when you start touching so much, uh, so much fish, your hands get really soft. to go. I stuck him good. There's no way he was coming off. There we go. Nice little snook, guys. See ya. Alright. I like when you try new spots and they start working out for you. Always gotta check for fray. So I just gotta retie. Get another one to hit. Oh my gosh, what was that? Big snook. He hit it on the real end. Oh God, that's a bigger snook, guys. 
That's a bigger snook, guys. I gotta be easy. He's pulling the boat. That's a big snook, guys. Oh my god. That was a bigger snook. I only got a 30 pound test on here. I gotta be careful. Oh my god. Gotta get the net ready. He's literally turning the boat. That's a nice snook, guys. That's a nice snook, guys. Oh my gosh, come on. Oh, yes. 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 Heck yeah, guys. A group of them just came through there. A group of these big snook came through, chasing bait. I think they came from out of that, uh, Marina, oh, I want to throw that back in there, it's alive. There we go, guys. Beautiful, beautiful snook. That is a healthy snook. Hell yes. I knew there had to be some big ones in here. I see them come through right underneath that boat, and a few of them came out and tried to start hitting that bait. So we're going to get this guy released, see if we can catch one or two more. We might call it a day after that one. Been out here for a couple hours and putting fish on the boat. Put them head first. Alright, now we just gotta make sure we check the frame. And we had that fish button, baby. Alright guys, we're about to move spots. Uh mm -hmm. I didn't even know I had that on spot lock. Yeah, we're about to move spot. I mean I got a couple fish out of here. Um I was chumming it up. Really didn't see too much activity. You did have a few here and there but nothing to sit here and waste time about. So I'm gonna pick up the trolling motor. We're gonna make another quick run. All right, guys, we're gonna call that a day. We had a great day today. I ended up getting uh, a few really nice snook, played with a lot of small snook, and my trophy of all today is that redfish. Uh, I just, I mean, I've been losing redfish in that spot for the last like few few trips, and finally today I seen something blowing up in the mangroves. I was like, okay, that has to be a bigger fish, but I wasn't sure if that was gonna be the the snook or is it gonna be the redfish. And I end up pitching a bait in there and all of a sudden I look down at the boat when I'm fighting it and it's a big redfish. So I am so stoked that I actually caught that redfish. Like, and I've seen a couple other ones that I thought was reds, or I thought was snook, but I, at the end of the day, I really do think there was uh, some more redfish in there. But unfortunately I was losing so many fish with the, the different hooks that I was using, they kept pulling. So, but I mean, overall today we had a really nice day. I had fun. I only fished for about three hours and we caught a lot of fish today. So guys, if you do like this video, please give me a thumbs up. It'll help the video out a lot. Drop me some comments below if you need some information, some tips, anything that you wanna know how I fish, the gear that I'm using, um, things like that. Just drop me some comments below. And if all, guys, do me a favor, come back and watch the next video. So until the next video, guys, tight lines, peace.